episode of Jaina Steel Zero Hour, where we attempt to focus on policy issues that require our attention and intervention as well. Today, we'll be discussing the upcoming seven census, uh, which is scheduled to take place in 2023. This particular census has been doing the rounds in the news, uh, mainly because this will be the first ever census in Pakistan's history to be digitized. And while we, we will be discussing that and other as aspects relating to this exercise, it is important to mention that the census is crucial for the fair distribution of resources, tax collection, representation in parliament, electoral processes, and um, also dealing with key governance issues such as growing urbanization and the evaluation of resources for infrastructure development. To discuss this very important issue, we have a special guest with us today, Dr. Zeba Sattar. They say you don't have any questions, but for those of us who aren't aware, uh, Dr. Sattar is a senior associate and has been directing the Population Council's office in Islamabad. She has over 25 years of experience focusing on social science research and also particularly looking at um, demographic dividend research that informs national policy discussions and developments. Thank you so much for being with us here Thank today, you. Dr. Sattar. Thank you. Um, so to start off, the last census in 2017, Kafi grievances the Kush provinces ki sind in particular when it comes to the enumeration ki jo methodology thi. So do you feel that the upcoming 2023 major census ho hai, uh, the methodology this time around will address some of those issues? Um, first of all, thank you for holding a program on the census and incidentally ye, um, jo forthcoming census hai, those are by skilly planned hai. So it's been planned and kind Kafi Jaldi plan who I pitched a che mini kender and the Sita Yari Hui and within six months, uh, Sabiani it will be the show will be on the road. So, is the Yari me mesmer steam ke agathura hum, uh, you know, we could have done better. And uh, though there is a chance to reflect ke jo uh, kami peshi aiti, those are satra me make it in a subsada jo confusion, what or synth or synth shikartha maga or sibi or subon sibi ye shikata shikayat aiti ke jo jab sawalat puchi ge koi gharane peja ke ke madam shamari jo hai wo bot inclusive hona chaye me felse. Apne bot a cha introduction kia ke yam kyun karte hai madam shamari. Taki Lonko Vasail Mene or on a basis of one person uh, equal uh, any equal ratio of resources. So um Hariku Ginna Bhot Zaruria. Aga Hariku Ginna Zaruria to me had say egg jo maslatha last time, ki kahi kahi double counting hui or kahi under counting hui. May yeni kasakti ke harjaga hui, maga kahi zada hui, kahi kam hui. मगर एक जो वजह थी जिसके हम बहुत खिलाफ थे कि आप यू नो एक तो आईडी कार्ड شناختی कार्ड इस्तेमाल किया गया जो कि कभी नहीं होना चाहिए सेंसस में हमने बहुत इसका खिलाफ किया मगर कुछ वजहों की वजह से उन्होंने प्रेफर किया कि इंक्लूड करें कि आपका شناختی कार्ड भी नोट करना उसकी वजह यह थी कि अगर हमने सवाल पूछा कि आप बताइए कि कितने अफराद हैं आपके घर में जो मार्च 23 2017 में जिन्होंने रात यानी सुबह वहां उठे थे और एक सवाल हिस्से का वो था और दूसरा था कि यानी जो आम तौर पे आपके यहां ये रहائش जहां जिनकी यहां है उसमें थोड़ा सा हमारा जो एक टेक्निकल टर्म में डिफेक्टेड जोर उसमें कंफ्यूजन आ गया और ज्यादातर जो जवाब देन थे उनकी दिमाग में कंफ्यूजन आ गया एक आप लोग पूछ रहे हैं आईडी कार्ड شناختی कार्ड उसमें हमारा जो होता है مستقل پرماننٹ ایڈریس ہوتا ہے جیسے اپ ابھی اسلام آباد میں ہو سکتا ہے کہ فیملی کراچی ہو اب اپ کنفیوژن کا شکار ہو گئے کہ اپ اپنی شناختی کارڈ وہ مانگ رہے ہیں تو میں کراچی کا لکھوں مگر رہ تو میں یہاں رہوں اور 6 مہینے سے زیادہ 6 مہینے کا کنڈیشن ہے تو شاید مجھے یہاں بھی ریکارڈ ہونا اور دیفو ڈبل کاؤنٹنگ ہوئی خاص طور پہ اپ کو پتہ ہے کتنے مائیگرنٹس ہیں جیسے जो ज्यादातर सिंध में माइग्रेंट्स हैं उनके तो यानी अबाई शहर वगैरह और घर तो यहां है केपी में और पंजाब में और उनमें कंफ्यूजन आई मैं समझती हूं कि अगर हम इस दफा हमने बहुत पूरी कोशिश की है कि वो सवाल पे जितनी हमारी मीटिंग्स हुई तीन मीटिंग्स हुई हैं क्वेश्चन है कमेटी उसी को क्लेरिफाई करने और मेरे ख्याल से बहुत हद तक हो गया है दूसरा जो मुझे लगता है कि जो नेक्स्ट लास्ट टाइम हुई कंफ्यूजन और इस दफा अल्लाह करे ना हो 
और आई होप रेडी के ना हो कि शेयरिंग ऑफ डेटा ट्रांसपेरेंसी जिसको कहते हैं वो नहीं थी यानी कि अगर आप खुल के अपनी खुल के बात नहीं कर रहे हैं तो जाहिर है और खुल के शेयर नहीं कर रहे हैं रिजल्ट्स तो सुबहों के साथ मैं भी प्रोसेस का हिस्सा थी और मेरे ख्याल से हमें बहुत जल्दी शेयर कर लेना चाहिए था ख़ासतौर पर सिंध बलूचिस्तान जिनकी कंसर्न थी कि भाई ये आपके रिजल्ट्स हैं हमने जब बिल्कुल रिड्यूस करने वाले थे अगस्त ट्वेंटी तो उनके साथ मेरे ख्याल से वहीं शेयर हुई उसी रात या मे बी नाइट बिफोर तो यानी ये नहीं हो सकता कि चेंजेस हो सकते हैं मगर आपकी कॉन्फिडेंस होती है अगर आपसे कोई right. बात सॉट ऑफ विद होल्ड की जाए तो आप समझते हैं इसमें बहुत ही कोई राज की बात है कोई मैनिपुलेशन एक्चुअली आई डोंट थिंक ऐसा मैनिपुलेशन था क्योंकि वहाँ प्रोसेसिंग उसी बिल्डिंग में हो रही थी हम लोगों को दिखाया जाता था प्रोविंशल विजिट्स भी थी सेंस कमिश्नर्स भी आए मीटिंग्स में मगर एक परसेप्शन परसेप्शन जो था ना वो ये था कि ओह मे बी सम कोकिंग इज गोइंग ऑन एक्चुअली नहीं था तो आई वुड से कि देवर रियल फ्लॉज डेटा कलेक्शन में दैट यानी अवॉइडेबल चीज़ें थी और सबसे अब ऑल मुझे लगता है कि हर चीज़ में कम्युनिकेशन बहुत अहम चीज़ होती है अगर आप अपनी वजूहत हम लोग हमने कमेटी में तो बहुत थ्रेश आउट किया क्यों आईडी कार्ड हम क्यों आर्मी को इन्वॉल्व कर रहे हैं आर्मी का बंदा भी एक फॉर्म भर रहा है और क्यों भर रहा है एंड ऑल दैट तो अगर ये आम शहरी और एटलीस्ट जो लीडरशिप है ना कम्युनिटी लेवल लोकल बॉडीज वगैरह अब हम देख रहे हैं कितनी अहम है उनके साथ शेयरिंग हो जाती कि ये ऐसे ऐसे होगा एक ड्राई रन हो जाता बहुत सी चीज़ें हो सकती हैं बिकॉज जो मकसद जो आपने कहा ना मुझे मैंने एक्चुअली आर्टिकल डॉन में लिखा था कि पीपल सेंसेस द सेंसेस इज फॉर द पीपल इट्स नॉट रजिस्ट्रेशन रजिस्ट्रेशन से भी बहुत कन्फ्यूजन uh, है जब जो नादरा को बुलाया गया और बहुत उनको स्पेस दी गई इसमें एक्सरसाइज में मगर नादरा तो बिल्कुल अलग इदारा है और सेंसस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन बिल्कुल अलग इदारा है सेंसस लोगों इंसानों के लिए गिनती के लिए उनके लिए सर्विस यानी उनको इक्वल राइट्स देने हकूक के लिए है मेरे मेरा ख्याल है इट्स सिविलियन एक्सरसाइज जो रजिस्ट्रेशन है उसमें आपका बर्थ्स का रजिस्ट्रेशन आता है डेथ मैरिज हम हर चीज़ के लिए नादरा जाते बट इट्स अ रजिस्ट्रेशन मैं अपने आप को प्रजेंट करती हूँ कि भाई मैं बताना चाहती हूँ ना आई एम आई एम सिंगल आई एम मैरिड आई एम विड वट एवर तो और आई हैव अ चाइल्ड इन द न्यू चाइल्ड और सब इट हेज़ डाइड इन माई हाउस होल्ड दैट्स अप टू मी आई एम प्रजेंटिंग माई हाउस होल्ड इन्फॉर्मेशन जो सेंसस है इट्स वेरी क्लियर समबडी इज़ कमिंग टू माई हाउस टू आस्क मी हाउ मनी पीपल आर लिविंग हेयर आई विल पार्टिसिपेट एंड एनी रिप्लाई आई गिव जो मैं जवाब दूँ चाहे कुछ जो रिकॉर्ड कर रहा है अगर उसको लगता भी है गलत उसका हक नहीं बनता कि मुझे चैलेंज करें क्योंकि जो मैं कह रही हूँ इससे एक जो फैसला हुआ है मगर आपने जो कहा कि इंटरनेशनल we all but they didn't listen to us magar is the fa cnic card is out chale na to ye bahut badi baat hai kyunki dekhiye ek bahut si aurte hain gareeb log hain the the very people we want to include in the census might tend to be marginalized if the if the id card is a condition for the inclusion i mean sure. social we know that um, so वो आउट हो गया है तो एक एक इम्प्रूवमेंट है मगर जस्ट जैसे मोर इंटिमिडेटिंग फॉर द पॉपुलेशन जी आई मीन इट्स लाइक पुलिसिंग सॉर्ट ऑफ थिंग तो एंड द अदर वन इज ऑफ कोर्स द प्रेजेंस ऑफ आर्म फोर्सेस आई हैव रिपीटेडली सेड बिकॉज़ आई वाज वेरी इन्वॉल्वड लास्ट टाइम आई आई डोंट नो हाउ मच आई एम बीइंग हर्ड आई डिड सी अ टिकट टेप्स रिफ्यूटिंग दैट बट आई थॉट दैट वी मेड द रिकमेंडेशंस टू द चेयरमैन ऑफ द प्लानिंग कमीशन हु वाज हेडिंग द कमेटी Uh, we don't need armed forces, except in very difficult areas. But the it's a very different situation. Seventeen, eighteen, maybe we were end of that fighting the war on terror, APS, whatever it was. So, up to now, the situation. Luckily, those situations are a little better. Yes, yes. That should improve the situation too. Thank you. So, what you have said, 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 what you
perception management and you were, as we were just discussing disclosure of data and timely management how that would help mm-hmm. uh as, as you've also written about this how the exercise of the census has been politicized do you feel that now 2017 ke baad ab 2022 mein jo ho raha hai there's a, a better understanding on part of the authorities as to why we conduct huh. this exercise well, it's a million dollar question um perhaps but i'm not sure kyunki ek cheez is hum recently i've just been on monday to uh, karachi and we're presenting a population situation as i mean there's very little that was our grievance ke bahut uh, minimal utilization here for census and why it's not the fault of sind government or punjab government magar jo actual detail jo uska micro results karte hain na to aapko tables mil gayi thi 17 mein ke प्रोविंसेस की क्या पॉपुलेशन है मेल्स कितने हैं फीमेल्स कितने हैं एज ब्रेक डाउन एम्प्लॉयमेंट ब्रेक डाउन एथनिक ब्रेक डाउन ऑल दैट वो तो अभी रिलीज हुए बिकॉज दे गोट टाइड अप इन द पॉलिटिक्स एज अ रिजल्ट देंसेज इज हार्डली बीन यूटिलाइज आई रिमेंबर आई थिंक वी स्पेंड आई थिंक कोई आठ मैंने सुना था कि इट वॉज एट बिलियन वॉज एंटिसपेटेड कॉस्ट इट वेंट अप ट्वेल्व आई थिंक इट वेंट अप फिफ्टीन सिक्सटीन वी स्पेंड अ लॉट ऑफ मनी on the census as we should magar did we use it and has it entered jis maqsad ke liye aur main bar bar wap saungi kyunki ye point agar hum apne viewers ko samjha sake jis maqsad ke liye primary maqsad hota hai taaki utne schools bane itne hospitals bane wo ilake ko itna pani pani ki zarurat hai basic services health services etc wo maqsad ke liye to minimize use hai it was used because it was um, deal it for a result that was required immediately which was carving out of constituencies for the election so that and then by extension of that nfc award right ke bhai aapko halanki next nfc award has really not progressed as fast but i i'll quote you uh, something that from somebody really reliable an economist uh, friend of mine ke uh, kp me celebrations ho rahe the क्योंकि सीट्स बढ़ गई थी एन एफ सी अवार्ड बढ़ गया था पंजाब में डिप्रेशन था कि हम आई कम हो गए सो इट गोज अगेंस्ट आर ओवरऑल पॉलिसी टू स्लो डाउन पॉपुलेशन ग्रोथ रेट्स बिकॉज यूर एक्चुअली एंड दिस वॉज वी हैड डिस्कशन पार्लियामेंटेरियन एस्टरडे एंड एग्जैक्टली अब फाइनली ये बात हो रही है कि वो जो पॉपुलेशन वाला फॉर्मूला इट्स नॉट वर्किंग इट्स वर्किंग अगेंस्ट अस एंड एटी टू एटी थ्री परसेंट है बेटर दैन द प्रीवियस एन एफ सी अवार्ड बट आई डोंट थिंक इवन द एन एफ सी अवार्ड इज द पार्लियामेंट्री सीट्स हमें छः सीट और मिल गई दो सीट कम हो गई पोलिटिकल रिप्रजेंटेशन का गेम है एंड टू आंसर योर क्वेश्चन विद आई एंटिसपेट ये जो जल्दी में हो रहा है वो जल्दी किस बात की है ये नहीं है कि हमें बहुत फिक्र है कि भाई अस्पताल नहीं बन रहे हैं स्कूल नहीं हो रहे हैं हमारे बच्चे आउट ऑफ स्कूल हैं ना दैट्स नॉट द मोटिवेशन सो आई एम अफ्रेड द आंसर इज दे आई मीन वी एंटिसपेट एन इलेक्शन एंड the powers that be are concerned about how we are going to whether we have additional constituencies here they were urban hongi rural hongi and i'd like to speak to that urban issue for the long if we have time right nahi no, bilkul uh, as you mentioned population control and you've written a lot about mm-hmm. this as well and i mean one can be optimistic ke i say this is tarah thoda sa rujhan bade but mm-hmm. public officials also in um we've seen them make such statements ke uh, population control and family planning is perhaps something that we need to look towards but rhetoric ke aage bhi kuch aap do you see any progress taking place um, first of all you know we are against the word control because it implies that of course, i, I right. should decide uh, or you should decide planning, or uh, management planning works better for us so um you know it's incredible how much Paks- pakistanis have moved forward and how our administrations remain behind for instance bar bar i have not yet to attend a meeting about these issues and we attend like i can tell you three just this week with different constituencies i mean yesterday was parliament jo mazhabi um, you know angle aa jata hai मजहबी स्कॉलर्स ने तो बहुत खुल के हमारे फेडरल टास्क फोर्स है उसमें मिनिस्टर ऑफ रिलीजियस अफेयर्स हेड ऑफ द काउंसिल ऑफ स्कॉल काउंसिल ऑफ इस्लामिक आइडियोलॉजी जी तो दे अग्री दे ब्रॉड के तो दैट इज नथिंग होल्डिंग बैक अगेंस्ट फैमिली प्लानिंग एज वेल एज यू कॉल इट बर्थ स्पेसिंग एंड यू से इट्स फॉर हेल्थ रीजन्स 
तो इट्स रियली एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव फेलियर्स दैट आर स्टिल नॉट गेटिंग रिजॉल्व बट आई वुड से कि यस इन द सिंस द द सीसीआई देयर वाज अ सीसीआई सॉर्ट ऑफ अटेंशन टू दिस डिसीजंस टेकन इन 2018 उसके बाद कुछ चहल पहल हुई है मगर उस तरह के रिसोर्सेज नहीं डाले पॉपुलेशन फ्रंट की आई थिंक बात हुई थी 10 बिलियन रुपीस अब बहुत ही अप टू डेट है और 10 बिलियन फंड इज बिकम बोन ऑफ कंटेंशन क्योंकि सिर्फ 1 बिलियन उसमें से रिलीज हुए हैं तो अब मैं यही कहती हूँ इंटरव्यूज वगैरह में कि अगर आप वन वन टेंथ निकालेंगे पैसे अपनी जेब से तो आपको वन टेंथ वर्थ लगेगा प्लस इट वाज अ फेडरली मैनेज फंड बट फॉर द प्रोविंसेस सो वो जो एक फेडरल एक नेशनल अथॉरिटी होती है ना कि यू पुट योर मनी बिहाइंड व्हाट यू आर सेइंग एज अ पॉलिसी इंस्ट्रूमेंट देन आई वुड से दैट जो फेडरल मैसेज जाता है वो कि वी डोंट वी हैव मनी फॉर अदर थिंग्स वी डोंट वी हैव मनी फॉर द सेंसस but we don't right. we're going to spend more than 10 billion on and secondly the the large chunk of the divisible pool is going to be based on numbers that you come up with so overall administratively i'm not saying logo mein jo hai na bahut shaur hai they realize ke their kids will not have a, a good chance they know that mothers will die they know ke health related issues hain education ke and employment issues now and up to ये जो एनवायरमेंट के भी इशूज आ गए हैं जो ऑल द इशूज वे ग्रैप्टिंग आर रिलेटेड टू फैमिली साइड बट एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिवली इफ यू थिंक अबाउट इट वी आर स्टिल कॉट इन द माइंड सेट ऑफ सेइंग मोर नंबर्स इट्स अ प्रो नेटलिस्ट पॉलिसी अंडरलाइन द ऑफिशियल पॉलिसी अबाउट रिसोर्सेज द बैलेंस बिटवीन पॉपुलेशन रिसोर्स इज स्टिल बेस्ड ऑन मोर पॉपुलेशन मोर रिसोर्सेज सो अंटिल वी चेंज दैट बट द इम्प्रूवमेंट इज येस्टरडे इज कॉन्वर्सेशन सिंस फ्रेश इन माई माइंड वॉज Shibli Faraz sir chaired the meeting in his uh, literally in the room uh, and that's next to his office he is the head of this parliamentary population forum and which was set up about uh, almost two years ago and um he finished his speech which he uh, uh, you know sort of and then he said oh i've forgotten something i think it's very important that we really relook at the nfc award and coming from a sitting minister within the sitting room I was encouraged. Okay, he remembered. He stopped, and he said, "Ki ye hai," and it also came up in the presidential, which the president, ki uh, the federal task force had attended that November twenty fifth. He also said, "We keep forgetting this issue, but it's been raised by chief ministers of Sindh and Balochistan, and we should do something." Who we tackle karenge na? So it's not that fixing this will fix a part. Of course, but message jayega. You know, ki we care about the quality of our people, not the numbers. Bilkul. So, no that's definitely encouraging and as you said the religious and cultural argument doesn't exactly hold since we yeah. have examples all around us i think you also pointed out in your articles that saudi arabia is also offering oh. family planning services uh, in their health oh. it's in the private sector but uh, indonesia is one of as islamic as we are in uh, bangladesh majority yeah. bangladesh i mean they just really uh, it's an administrative failure it's not religion because it na we not like catholicism If Catholicism had a clear <clears throat> like negative. See, Islam. I think only thing we can't say is just like you can't say the word control. Yeah, we have to you know stopping children. Sterilization won't be a popular method because there there should be reverse, and that's what human rights are about. There should be a, a, a choice. It's based on choice and free choice, and your ultimate right to have the number of children you want. So if I I can't stop now because after two, maybe in a few years, when one might want to have two more. So uh, we are not really recommending permanent methods. But up to there's a variety of very effective short cut spaced uh, spacing methods. That's what we are promoting. So, but religion is an excuse. I, I just quote from um, Bulich Sangh, Chief Minister X One. He said, "Religion is an excuse behind which we should not hide our administrative and you can say governance failures." बिल्कुल यू नो इट्स इट्स अ नाइस कि और रिलीजियस वो नहीं पसंद करते आपने और कुछ किया है टू सेटिस्फाई देम नो आई मीन दिस इज योर जॉब ऑफ कोर्स देयर इज अ लॉट दैट आई मीन कम्युनिकेशन एंड फ्रेमिंग ऑफ द इशू देयर इज अ लॉट दैट यू कैन डू टू अपीज देम ऑफ कोर्स ऑल इट यू नो हाफ अ प्रॉब्लम प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ पाकिस्तान आर रियली अराउंड फ्रेमिंग इफ यू गो इन वेव अ रेड फ्लैग इन फ्रंट ऑफ बोल यू यू विल गेट देम बट यू जस्ट कन्विंस देम इट्स अबाउट नेगोशिएशन एंड टॉलरेंस एंड अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ ईच अदर सो राइट Right. Now, uh, among other encouraging aspects, um, I've been reading that this time around there will be an attempt. I'm not sure exactly what they mean by an attempt, but 
टू फैक्टर इन पर्सन विद डिसबिलिटीज एंड इवन ट्रांस पीपल तो उसके ऊपर अगर आप थोड़ी सी रोशनी डाल सकें बिल्कुल द लास्ट मीटिंग वी हैड आई थिंक इज एग्जैक्टली अ मंथ अगो लीव मी वी स्पेंड द होल मीटिंग ऑन डिसबिलिटीज एंड आई एम आई एम हैप्पी टू से कि आई थिंक दिस टाइम राउंड आई डेंट रियली डिवेल ऑन द एन आई सी कार्ड थिंक वॉज आई डन इनफ ऑफ दैट एन आई सेट के दिस स्टिल गोइंग टू डू यू नो टू दैट वॉज अ बट ऑन द वी हैड अ विन ऑन द डिसबिलिटीज क्वेश्चन बिकॉज उन्होंने कहा कि देखिए um i mean maybe hum andar ki baat hai but there was some push back about we, if you really want to measure disabilities you need three of questions but because of this uh, digital census you know wo up options offer kar sakte hain so there were, we did win there were two or three of us who really felt very passionately very strongly about the disability i mean i feel ki if you're going the census the only time you will get a number on the number of people who are disabled but we also want to know the extent of the disability and the type of the disability of course. So, so now this drop down menu allows us to ask two or three questions because there'll only be hopefully only about under 10% under 5% who are disabled i don't know what the number is let's say 10% so 90% will be excluded but at least on those we need detail about the impairment levels so i'm very happy about that about transgender wo to i remember ke there was a supreme court order to include them and it was absolutely ridiculous because uh, ek column tha usme humme sab kuch include karna tha we had to accommodate and it was ridiculous that we just didn't change the form just because it required new and it was a ridiculous reason not to do it but in one form we recorded uh, trans i mean gender whether it was trans and disability in one line one column so the options were this was a way of accommodating a very important request ke male disabled female disabled transgender disabled so you have six codes um how do you get that who how many people are going to come forth and report disabled yes. people but if you ask about each persons as you are supposed to har ek ka naam ke against and do they have any disabilities so you can easily say no can they ke if they do then you get the details so mm-hmm. the same with transgender now at least it is in one column only which records gender right. even then i think uh, uh the proof of it will lie in the training okay transgender we don't come forward that easily so of course and nay this brings us to our next question aapne baat ki of course now tech gives you the option of drop down menus but at the same time you said training given the digital divide i mean sensitivity training uh, technology wali training and also implementing this at such a large scale it's not just yes handing out the tablets to those who are conducting the survey but also uh, processing that data uh, do you feel that we 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 have the capacity to implement it at that scale you know um, the the new incoming chief statistician we brought one after a long time um he came to my office and we discussed this quite deeply this camp kaise taiyari karenge itni jaldi you know that so i mean i didn't want to discourage him because if a if a decision is taken so i know ke jo bisp hai benazir income support program then their registry they have but they took really long but they've done almost 20 million households and they have used a tab and i don't know how deeply they've got uh, these disabilities etc but the digit what they calling a digitized census is essentially using tabs and it's going to help a lot because of the processing i mean you know i remember ke wo gatte bante the of those printed things and then they'd go to the either the union council ya pata nahi kya and you know wahan stamp hote the big rasi band ke fir they were physically sent to islamabad for processing and i do not know the details of this but i don't think processing requires forms now to come to islamabad i mean it should be immediately entered and uh, i mean that that should be an improvement i mean there should always be provision for cross checks other to cross checks up andar hi build in kar sakte hain as you know into the program but if this cross verification then they can have a follow up team cross verifying ki koi wrong entry wagera to nahi hui that right. thing but we do this all the time in our service but you i think you're right the scale is too high a lot of the people that we use for um, you know they are usually like low level t- you know not for the primary school teachers or lady health workers or something like that so i'm not sure how 
how you know adept they will be with this um, you know to, it's all in the training right it could, I mean, it could also if, raise if, if everyone pakistan the most educated can do an sms on a mobile phone they can certainly but it's in training um, and i think it, my fear is that we are sh- taking some shortcuts here so what will get sacrificed is the training we strongly recommend as a committee to have a, like a you know full pilot and i don't mean just a pilot in islam but but a pilot in a really far far area last time by the way there's no pilot that i remember and no post enumeration survey which is another thing that i hope we manage to do this time because in the post enumeration survey you can pick out a lot ke apne areas uncovered questions that didn't go very well that sort of thing right no definitely as as you said i mean concern is ke i mean of course introducing technology will rectify a lot of the issues oh. but it could also raise more issues going forward if it <laughs> isn't it's like the evm properly. thing exactly exactly <laughs> it might solve some basic one but really it's hairy you know when gone wrong i don't know what might yeah. happen yeah. so uh nature the one can hope for the best but uh, it's 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 uh, progression it's progression for sure is the other countries like the us i mean and often hamari would do ek do bahut hi high tech se log hain they give the examples of the us that you send a question and it doesn't happen like that in pakistan you know in fact receive even if i receive a question i'm not going to answer my personal details so i think that physical way going <coughs> from home to home is necessary right you know? But you know, I was just thinking that if we have the screen, if we have the answers, there are we, the screen could be shared with the person for whom you're collecting at the end of the interview. It's all right, can I tell you? But at the same time, I mean, if I'm ima- imagining a scenario just hmm. for the conversation's sake, okay, the other person who is not exposed to technology, ah, उसको समझ में नहीं आएगा. Challenges बहुत ज़्यादा होते हैं. बहुत challenges. ये दोहराते हैं ना, ये कुछ कर दे ताकि उसकी. बिल्कुल. It's all about confidence building. How do I know what you've written down for me is correct? So, if I just simply two minutes or take it, I will give you a hint that you are a fellow, you are a twenty-year-old. Let me guess that you are a twenty-year-old. A twenty-year-old, at least you have a master's. You know, whatever right. your education level, you are employed. You have no disability, and you are from Lahore. But you are still a Muslim. just that basic information you know or aapke panch household members hain teen just something that but they 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 obsessed i think the whole administrative process is get rush through this which is worrying us okay what what's the rush we must get it right not the rush but rush pe bahut emphasis hai hame karna hai before i think before december we have to have the results december 22 I think that's what the December year, or even earlier. <laughs> Chale, nee, this brings us to our last question, and you you spoke about building trust. Um, have we made? I mean, of course, that is a long term process. The trust deficit is to bridge that. But do you see um, us taking any steps towards that communication strategy? I know you've talked about that to steal a phrase of yours. To hmm. like, how do we ensure that they realize that this is an exercise for the counted and not for the counters? Yeah. Yeah, I, um, you know, I must say that um, the deputy chairman who started these discussions on behalf of Asad Umar Sab, uh, the Minister of Planning and Development, um, he really got that point. Uh, he, we made that point, and he said we must spend as much on communications as we do on training, practically. So we build that trust. He really got the point. But there, you know, up it's back to the the administrative processes. So I hope that and now we are focusing on the questionnaire and the modalities. But I do think, for instance, that I was really quite shocked that when we released the results, release, that the, the um, at that particular point, I co-chaired a meeting which was Sindh government had come, and they were Sindh government and Rajasthan government literally asking the PBS, Pakistan Bureau of Statistics, that had conducted, that we will get our results. Will they be there? And uh, these were the census commissioners of those provinces. And he said, I, I said, I just don't see why not. And there was a kind of misunderstanding that. It's confidential. I I just want to use this program to say what is confidential is your personal information. So if I repeat it to you, that's all right. Okay, you're Mr. X, and but otherwise you're anonymous for me. I'm not going to ever repeat that information. Right. Neither will there be an identifier. As with every technology that we could use, but I don't think we're going to do it. Is really in the housing census, which measures, um, which assesses, counts 
housing structures, whether the institutions, shops, which would be a way of ensuring inclusion of kache badis and right. boats and all that, right. especially Karachi, may have been exploited. Should be GIS. I mean, we have that technology. So we should have, and last time we recommend, I have a feeling they're not going to do it, but that technology is available. Um, GIS ka map ho, to then if they're on a tab, you should be able to see whether we've covered the, you know, at least the periphery of that area. Right. Or at least that your interviews, it should light up and show me that you've covered. It's really a way of looking at coverage that's, you know, I mean, not that costly. I don't think it seems to be a matter of will because GIS no, this, isn't exactly. new technology. Either. Yeah, it's not. Right. There, there are restrictions to its use, though. Right, okay. Yeah. We'd like to thank Dr. Zeva Sattar for joining us today to discuss this very important topic. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel on YouTube so that you can stay up to date with our upcoming podcasts and webinars. Thank you once again for joining us.